Hey guys, and welcome to another Factorio workshop. As always, I am joined by Mad Zuri. Greetings. And today we're going over uh, two builds here. Well, this is just a scaled down version of this one, uh, but this is a red circuit build uh, that Zuri made, but it is inspired by a previous uh, red circuit submission uh, by Marvin TR, which is up uh, over here. I'm showing on my screen. So it's inspired by this design, but expanded out and uh, change a little bit. So I'll let you go over all this series since it is yours. Sure. I decided to make it so that it would output a fully compressed blue belt. Mm -hmm. So it would consume two full blue belts of circuits, copper, and plastic, which is a lot to feed this monster. Yeah. All the machines work 100% with no downtime. And again, eats fully compressed belts and outputs fully compressed belts. Mm -hmm. I have this little trick I'm actually quite proud of, of using the JG Games uh, splitter design woven into the previous uh, inputs uh, that Marvin used for his design. Yeah, so this is, uh, when I, when Zuri first showed this to me, I was fascinated by this. It's, it's very cool and almost hard to see what's going on until you actually mouse over everything. So you're used a lot utilizing the, uh, JD game, JG games thing, but then also the belt weaving. So, um, he's using the blue belt here to go underneath these yellow belts for the circuits and, uh, plastic. And this sends the copper all the way down. And then these guys just grab straight off of it and then using um, the splitters and more um, underground belts to kind of just make a very nice compressed um, thing to send all the materials where they need to go. And, and uh, you yeah. can swap around the copper and plastics if you want to input them the other way around, all the way up top up here. As long as copper's in the middle, it'll work fine. Right. And then Exterminator asked me if I could do this for Red Belt and puts instead in Tier 2 machines. And I'm like, actually, yes. Yeah, so that's what we have over here. It's not quite 100%. It'll use the, all the machines 100%, but it's only about 90% using the belt and output. So you will see gaps in this. Yeah. Also, I had to use slightly different belt weaving tricks and had to add a gap in here. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good point. So the belts aren't exactly the same as the one on the right. This one's actually retooled completely to use the length of the red underground belts. Yeah, so this is a nice scaled down design if you just want level two machines and only red belt inputs. Now, just a quick note for anyone who's super observant, you may notice we are using blue belts straight from the source things, but that's just so the source things work correctly. You don't need any blue belt in this design. Um, and then we are using side loading here again, because it is only about a 90% of a red belt output. Um, however, uh, we did forget to mention on this design over here, uh, you are using um, splitters to actually combine it. Yeah, you cannot get 100% compression with side loading on a belt. Yeah, so he has to use splitters here to combine it. You can see it is a full red belt here. And then uh, pretty much it. Uh, he, you know, using two cable machines for 12 um, per side uh, red circuit machine. So correct ratio there. Obviously I'm modeled, but even so, uh, both these designs together seem to produce about 3.8-ish K circuits a minute. Um, so if we were to turn off, say, like the left one, or not, I don't know, where is it getting power? It must be, oh, they're connected across. Um, yeah, so this, uh, this one should produce quite a bit. There we go. So that one's turned off. If we look now, it is slowly declining. I'm guessing it'll go to maybe 2K. 2.3k ish, 2.4 for this. It should be 2.4, yeah. Yeah, so like 2.2.4k red circuits a minute on this, and uh, yeah, very very cool design. I was very impressed when I saw this. Uh, really nice 
belt weaving and splitter tricks here and uh very nice looking oh and something else i want to touch on you went um you did an excellent job with the power pull ocd oh it's yeah absolutely perfect <laughs> So this is very, very nice. Colonel Will would be very happy with this. Um, yeah, I'm surprised he hasn't used it yet. He may not know about it. Or did you show it to him? I swear I did. Hmm. He may not have remembered. I don't know. But uh, I think that's going to do it. Are there? Is there anything I forgot or anything else you forgot you wanted to cover here? I'm pretty sure we got it all. Alrighty. Well, there you go, guys. Uh, I will put both blueprints um, in the description for this one and then the scaled down version as well since it is different um differently configured so that's going to do it for this as always thanks for watching hope you enjoyed if you did feel free to leave a like and we'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments as always but until next time we will see you later later